Dobre, odrážam vrš, samá pagiera samá vrš. Tudia jem gojím to mýk pumpkin bread z Starbucks copycat pumpkin bread. Kýsi ako môžem vôr pumpkin bread, ono? A to je dáva, bo by sa vým pomôcť na kúť. So be careful when you buy pumpkin that already cut, you have to use to use it as soon as possible. Jadi, jadi ketika membeli lagu harus segera digunakan kalau nggak ada jamuran, hancur jamuran. Oke, okay. problem. All we have to do is just have uh, to cut it. So here I buy like this, cut it one. This is pumpkin. So we're going to sting this first. We're going to make pumpkin puree first for one and half cups of pumpkin puree sekitar satu setengah cups uh, labu ya, daging labu nah ini berapa ya pokoknya itu satu kilonya itu uh, almost 100 rubel sampai hampir 100 rubel ya ini lebih daripada dua kilo nah ini oke okay. all we have to do, we have to peel and then cut it and then we are going to steam this kita tinggal potong kemudian di kukus. Okay, for top the topping of pumpkin puree, I have this one, the seed. Actually, uh, this one, this one like smells, uh, smells rosary, there's it. Di fundukong. Nah ini ada kacang hazelnut sama biji-biji biji-bijian ya, biji labu, ini biji labu. Kemudian ada kayak merica itu, merica, merica merah nah, mungkin bisa ini kan off topping the joy bisa digunakan topping apa aja kita, kita siapkan dua telur dua telur besar so one big, uh, two big eggs oke okay. jadi seperti ini ya, potong seperti ini mungkin nah, this thing so it's very beautiful jadi bagus sekali ya now uh, let's start her, it's already cold here My pumpkin puree sudah dingin ya. Nah, sekarang uh, ini adalah apa namanya ya? Kismis. Nah, this one is kismis raisin. Dry raisin they already boil with water first so it becomes soft. Ini uh, kismis saya rendam ya. Ini kismis kering ya. Saya rendam dulu. Saya rebus dulu di air anget air panas okay so let's start so first of all we break two eggs kita pecahkan dulu dua telur here this large egg jangan lupa yang ambil yang besar ya here we are going to mix first kita akan kocok dulu ini ada rata aja just kiss this enakan ini saya nah, telurnya dulu first time this egg and then uh, we put uh, sugar sugar around one and half cups of sugars satu setengah cup gula ya gula pasir It's just like this one for one cup I use 250 milliliter sekitar 250 liter ya yang pakai seperti ini standard one so here like this nah, sekarang kita aduk sampai uh, gulanya tercampur rata until Until sugar become dissolve. Uh, give vanilla a bit, kasih vanilla. Okay, give uh, this one just a pinch of vanilla for finally here. And then mix until stop. Okay, dia tergambur rata semua gula-gula ini ya oke, okay, ready a bit dissolve ini sudah 
larut ya tapi nggak terlalu larut sih ya udah nggak apa-apa udah masuk warnanya sekarang kita kasih pumpkin puree for minimal preheat your oven jangan lupa dipanaskan dulu ovennya karena kita ini pakai minyak nanti kalau belum panas dia turun so like this okay one and cup first and then and half cukup diambil yang bukan airnya ya just take okay it's enough Tower. Okay, then uh, you stir. Ini ya. Nah. Tapi jangan terlalu uh, semangat ngaduknya. Asal aja. If over mix, it will be not good for you. Nah, already like this. Then we put um, mana ya minyak saya? This one, you can use cooking oil, I use avocado oil, you can use sunflower oil, kita sepertiga aja, sepertiga cup, so, mana ya, this one, just uh, less than quarter cup, one, three cup, this here, ambil dia dok ya, turun nah sambil pakai ini aja nah please oke okay. baru kita masukkan uh, terigu sedikit demi sedikit nah, ini like this then we give all purpose flour a little bit by a little bit here I use two cups of two cups of all purpose flour. Dua cup all purpose flour. Kita masukkan sedikit demi sedikit. Hmm. Sambil diaduk. Hmm. And put also half teaspoon of salt. Nah, setengah sendok teh garam masukin. I put all for all purpose flour here and then we put uh, already put the uh, half teaspoon of salt sudah saya masukkan setengah sendok tahu garam juga sekarang kita masukkan baking powder sama baking soda now we put baking powder and baking soda here for one for baking powder we use half, uh, one teaspoon of baking powder satu sendok teh baking powder kemudian setengah sendok teh baking soda so half teaspoon of baking soda we put here And then uh, we put um, pumpkin spices two teaspoon, two sendok teh ya. Kita letakkan di atasnya. So two teaspoon. This is the spices that I made by myself. You can see from the link. Hmm. Okay. Done. Then uh, we put also half teaspoon of only half teaspoon of cinnamon powder, setengah sendok teh aja cinnamon banyak-banyak ya setengah sendok teh aja, kayu bubuk oke okay. and then we mix, yang kita campurin Oke, okay, don't over mix. Kalau sampai rata aja udah cukup. Kita lebih ke sparkle. Then we put uh, this raisin. Sekarang kita masukin raisinnya. We may use half cup of raisin and half cup of walnut. I don't have walnut. Saya nggak punya uh, kenari ya. Atau kacang, kacang apa namanya? Begitu. Nah, 
jadi ini kismis kemudian saya kasih lagi uh, this one I put dried cherry here see because I like this one sweet and sour taste this one gitu ya also just one teaspoon can put also inside pumpkin seed setengah aja kita campurin nah, sekarang kita tinggal campurin semuanya oke okay, I think done Okay, now we are going to put into pan. So, sudah siapkan loyangnya. You can grease it, but I don't want to use to grease. Just use this one. Nah, ini ya. Tinggal uh, dimasukkan aja ke sini. Okay, we put like this. Make sure we put all. Ratakan. dikasih di atasnya ini on top of this may put this one okay okay and then cover with this uh, pumpkin seed nah ya kemudian dihentakkan kemudian dihentakkan ya jadi dia uh, to throw the to say to throw the, uh, the air like this. like this okay make it like this okay now we are ready to bake sekarang kita siap untuk ke manggang kita rapikan dikit ya saya enggak Pertaburan kemana-mana gitu. Ini, okay dan, I hope it's good. Because this is the first time for me to bake this. Ini ya. Okay, now let's bake for uh, until it becomes golden brown. Sampai dia masak. So this is the result of my pumpkin bread. See, I bake for how long? One hour and 15 minutes, something like that. Jadi satu jam yang membelas menitan. So it depends on also uh, on your oven. Jadi tergantung oven masing-masing ya. Nah ini sudah uh, dry already dry is good. And then you have to toss with skewers like this uh, with this tooth. What is what do you call? I mean something like this. See, there is no uh, dough that attach it means that already awesome uh, so after we let it cool first for a while kita biarkan dulu sampai dia udah mendingin ya di sini aja udah gak panas lagi baru nanti dipindahkan dan we take it from this because it's very hot and then uh, don't cut directly even already cool uh, to make a great result so better tomorrow let it uh, tomorrow after you already um, cut it tomorrow you may put into a jar into airtight jar and then it can be it can it can be still good until for this or you can put in refrigerator that's all just put into something uh, some place that airtight jadi letakkan di kalau sudah didinginkan ya besoknya dipotong uh, baru diletakkan di toples atau di kayak yang wadah itu ya yang kedap udara itu nah, itu bisa tahan 4 hari atau ditutup aja or just cover with aluminum foil aluminum foil that's all and put into refrigerator oke okay. nah ini enak sekali jadi ini bisa dimakan begitu aja atau dikasih selai bisa selai kacang atau selai apapun yang disuka so you can uh, eat this just directly or with uh, jam peanut jam or whatever whatever jam you like for example pineapple or strawberry jam something like that I will uh, show you later 
how I cut tomorrow. Jadi saya akan kasih lihat nanti yang sudahnya itu pas uh, besok ya, pas dipotong. Jadi dia bagus hasilnya. Nah, ini sih bagus kan? Oh. Oke. Okay. Okay, I think that's all for today's recipe. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like, comment, and don't forget to press notification button so you never miss our every video. Jadi jangan lupa untuk berangganan, kemudian di share, di like, di comment, dan di tekan tombol notifikasinya supaya kamu gak ketinggalan video-video kami selanjutnya. That's the right, Rational Wars. Sampai jumpa lagi, Rational Wars. Paka-paka. What is it? I already let it cook. Nah, ini sudah saya dinginkan dan ditaruh di atas tempat untuk manggang sauce lagi gitu ya so this is I put into like for to put meat here for sauce lid because I don't have cooling rack karena saya nggak punya uh, apa namanya tempat untuk yang khusus untuk mendinginkan kue ya atau mendinginkan cake jadi saya pakai yang untuk kalau biasa dipakai untuk sauce lid gitu ya mana see how beautiful it is smells very good because I use pumpkins because I use pumpkin spices that I made by myself jadi saya gunakan um, bumbu apa namanya bumbu labu dari bumbu labu yang saya bikin sendiri ya Ini. ada juga kayak manis wangi sekali oke, okay. nah besok nanti uh, mungkin saya akan kasih lihat kalau sudah dipotong ya oke okay. baru nanti saya upload oke okay. nah ini hasilnya setelah dipotong kesekian harinya so this is the result after I already cut nah after tomorrow ya ini ya so beautiful ini soft moist and very delicious ini enak sekali oke okay, let's try hmm. so the sweetness of this cake is balanced not too sweet but sweet ini di, tidak terlalu manis tapi manis ya manisnya pas Okay. You should try this at home, it's very delicious. Okay. Okay. That's all. Bye bye.